On today's podcast, we'll be talking about the fourth S of the 5S methodology, standardize. So stay tuned. Welcome to Warehouse Safety Tips. If you're a seasoned vodcast viewer, this vodcast is going to be different from most that you watch. It's based around exactly what the name implies, Warehouse Safety Tips. And since the people in this industry are busy, we know that time is money, so each episode will be as short and to the point as possible. And now, with all that out of the way, let's get to the vodcast. Over the last couple of weeks, we've been taking a bird's eye view of the 5S methodology. Here's a quick wrap up of what we've covered so far. In episode 159, we touched on the origins of 5S. In episode 160, we covered sort. As it applies to 5S, sorting involves going through your work areas and facility and determining what's essential and non-essential. In episode 161, we covered straighten, aka set in order. As it applies to 5S, straightening involves making everything essential quickly and efficiently accessible. It also entails making sure that items are organized by priority of use. In episode 162, we covered shine. As it applies to 5S, shining involves cleaning at regular and efficient intervals. It also allows you to ensure everything in your workplace is operating correctly and efficiently. And just like that, we arrive at the next S, standardize. As it applies to 5S, standardization is the organization of the first three S's. It takes sorting, setting in order, and shining, and puts systematic routines into place, ensuring all three are implemented in the safest and most efficient manner possible. Everyone on your team should be 100% knowledgeable in not only completing the routines, but also in their constant improvement. Next week, we'll discuss the next S of the 5S methodology, Sustain. Until then, Thank you for being part of another episode of Warehouse Safety Tips. Have a great week and stay safe. Before moving on, here's a word from one of our sponsors. If you've ever been to or worked in a warehouse, you know just how important safety is to both management and staff. It's almost impossible to go 10 steps without seeing safety tape, angles, signs, and or safety products. It's these items that show us how to be safe and avoid danger in the workplace. And if you're looking for the best products to make this happen, look no further than Mighty Line. Mighty Line floor signs and floor markings offer the best industrial products out there. We're proud to have Mighty Line as the official floor sign and floor marking company for the Warehouse Safety Tips podcast and site. Go to MightyLineTape.com forward slash safety tips to request a sample pack of their incredible safety signs and floor markings. We hope you enjoyed this episode of Warehouse Safety Tips. If you visit WarehouseSafetyTips.com, you'll find the show notes for this episode and access to all of our blog posts, previous podcasts, advertiser information, and much more. Thank you for listening to Warehouse Safety Tips and have a safe day.